How's it going guys? I'm the Raging Lake and welcome back to the channel. We're back for week four of the EBL, the Elite Bal League. We're not doing too well, we're all in three. And we're up against Sly Guy of the San Antonio Spurs, who is 3-0, undefeated. So we're going to see how it goes. I can't think it's going to be anything amazing, but we'll do our best. We've changed the team up a little bit. We'll see in a second. Let's put this code in first, though. Before we get into this battle, why don't you just like, comment, subscribe, share the video with a friend, share the channel with a friend, all that good stuff. Oh, put the code. But help if I put the code in right. Oh, there we go. There we go, that should be right now. Use code RAGING10 for 10% off at the checkout at TCG Exchange when you use, when you spend £10 or more. Um, don't forget to subscribe to all the people, the, all the amazing creators who are part of the EBL. They will be dropped down in the description as always. But let's just get into this battle. Perfect. Um, so, Sly Guy's going to choose the rules and everything. I'd have to worry about all that. Thank goodness. But, as you'll see, we've changed the team up. Or not. Where is our... Um... None of these teams are what I wanted, actually. I had pre-registered a team to this slot, but I guess we'll just do it now. Don't know why that's not saved. But it's fine. Um, so... I think everyone's going to expect us to bring the dragons. So we're not going to. Also... Um, no. Let's check somewhere. We've got a new, got a new carbon knight. Obviously, he's not going to be part. She's not going to be part of the team. But I was randomly playing through. Found a shiny. What a win! Um, oh, I don't think. I feel like maybe it's yeah. It's not saved anything. I had trade the team up. Improved the stats, changed around some of the moves. But I guess we're not going to see that. I have to do it all again. And hopefully remember to save it this time. I think that's what we're going to go with. Um, that our team then, yeah? That's the team we're choosing. Yeah, I'd, I'd changed, I'd updated some of the movesets, but apparently that's not saved, but it's fine. It'll be alright for next battle. I'll have to just redo it. But yeah, like I said, I feel like everyone's going to expect us to come in with... Let's see, I'd put a steel move on the carry on, that would have been great for the Mamswine, but it's fine. I feel like everyone was going to expect us to come in with the dragons, so we've decided to change it up and not bring the dragons this time. Hopefully that pays off for us. We're going to lead with Lucario, and then everyone else can just be in a random order. It doesn't really matter, does it? That's so annoying. I'm so annoyed with myself. Why didn't I save it? Idiot. Oh well, it's fine. I mean, it still probably might not have made a difference anyway. But we'll see. We'll see. As long as we don't get swept again. Which is looking very likely. We'll be fine. As I said, Sly Guy is undefeated. So, our chances aren't looking too great. 
We've been done a bit dirty there. Last week we faced up against the champion. This week we're facing up against someone who's a defeated. We can't catch a break. I wonder who he's going to lead with. That's going to be interesting to see. Queen Latifah. Is the mama swine. I'm going to hope that we are faster. Because we've not been outspeeding anything in any of the three matches. Or he's going to change it then. Surely. Because we have four times. Um, four times super effective move in the fighting move. So we still have a good type advantage. Oh, you're going to use Earthquake. That's going to kill me. Yeah. And that's all she wrote. I feel like it's gonna predict me going into that soon. Um so we're gonna go into take a risk going to Odin. Cause we will the ice might kill us off. But we will have the advantage over Stealth Rock, I like it. Set yourself up. We'll have the advantage over the ground. Because we really mean, you know. Um If I'd known he was gonna go for a I can't take the risk of setting up anything because my Pokemon just very weak at the moment. It's like the Steel Wing's not going to kill it. I could have gone for the Dynamax. Yeah, going to withdraw Queen Latifah. That's fine. I could have gone for. We're gonna mm, should we Dynamax Max Ice Stream? A risk, I know. But at this point, we've got nothing to lose. It's probably not a good idea to go for the Dynamax here, but we've gone for it anyway. I know obviously what um is gonna have an electric fight move, which is probably gonna kill us. But we're gonna hope that we outspeed it. Willow Wisp? Oh, so you're gonna burn us. Okay, that's fine. It's gonna lower our attack down. But we'll hit him with the max air screen. And that's gonna boost our speed, which is gonna be great. Yeah, we'll go for it again. This is gonna just stall out our Dynamax turns. But it's fine. It's fine. I feel more optimistic about this. Slightly. I mean, this could be our longest battle yet, you know. Vault Switch. Very smart. You're gonna go into. It was still faster than us. Amazing, man. Oh, go, going back into Queen Tifa. Okay, I like it. You're going to tank that max air screen. Our speed is even higher. We're going to hope that we outspeed it. We should do. Because Mama Swine is quite slow. I think we have to. But he's probably gonna 
predict the max steel strike and switch out. No? Steel spike? That's what it's called, not steel strike. That is a bulky Pokemon. That. And we've got a critical hit, which is amazing. I wonder who's going to send that now. It is... We are quite fortunate that we've got the speed boost from... from the Max Airstream, actually. Because even though we are going to... Odin's going to be after the sacrifice. We're going to send out Mo again. Hopefully, with our inc ever increasing speed, that should be enough. I'm gonna sacrifice if we outspeed it. Yeah, it's a sacrifice I was willing to make. It's gonna do a nice bit of damage. We got the critical hit. I didn't kill, but Vault Switch is gonna kill us. Yeah. It's going to be interesting to see who he's going to send out now. He's got, I think he's got the Kyogre and the Zygarde with him. So does he have to choose first who he's going to send out? Are we going to see who it is? Rengoku. We are gonna. We are gonna. Who can send that? Um, could do start this starter, but I feel like we're gonna send out the right tree. Hopefully. Hope. I mean, we're definitely not gonna outspeed it. This. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. But hopefully we manage to survive a hit from the Blaziken. Quite sad if we didn't, actually. Come on. What's he going to do? Flare Blitz. Definitely not going to survive that, right, you? I'm not going to write you a love song. Because you're dead. Yeah, speed boost. Mm. It's gonna have to be that soon. Start versus that. Natsu's already lost so much health from that. The stealth rock is really doing his dirty. And he's gonna be faster. He's gonna use Stone Edge. Natsu is gone. That is going to be all she wrote. Because that's just going to keep getting faster and faster. Uh, don't have. Decidueye and Glacier aren't going to do much, are they? But it's fine, it's fine. Don't worry about it. Flare Blitz, yep. As expected, Sidueye is down. But he's going to get speed boost. Maybe we should have sent out Glaceon. This is not going to be. It's not going to be good for us, is it, really? I feel like maybe if we'd maybe if we had actually remembered to save when we'd updated all the stats and everything, we would have done a little bit better. But 
That is game. There's a reason that it's three and oh. But I'm not gonna lie. That's our best battle. Yeah, we've done pretty well there. We got another KO. It seems to be a pattern of swept one KO, swept one KO. So we did pretty well there. Yes, received the lead card. I'm pretty happy with how we've done that, actually. Um, but that's going to be it. That's going to be it for week four. I'm definitely going to get the team changed up. Stats improved, moves improved, and everything. And I think this team is going to be one that maybe we'll stick with a little bit more. Well, thanks so much for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed that. If you did, leave a like, comment, subscribe. Share the video with a friend. Share the channel with a friend. Use code RAGING10 for 10% off when you spend £10 or more at TCG Exchange. Get those Scarlet and Violet pre-orders in. And drop subscribe to all the wonderful um, competitors in their EVL. Coaches, that's the word I was looking for. Drop a subscribe to all the wonderful coaches that are going to be dropped down in the description. Thanks so much for watching guys, keep on collecting, bye!